Hello everyone, I'm Danny from Work in Nature. My viewer Francesca has asked me how to get rid of scale insects and I have to tell you I've never had trouble with scale insects until now. As you can see I have a pretty bad infestation on my symbiome market. And uh, yeah, why not? I'm gonna make a video on how I would go about it. I have to tell you, I've never dealt with this before, so I'm not sure about the foolproof method, but um, for this reason, I added a link in the description of this video with some directions and more information from the AOS, I believe. Anyway, check it out, it's really useful. I'm gonna try to follow those instructions or just um, try to adapt them to my uh, particular needs and my particular environment and so on. Um, so yeah, let's see how to go about this. Okay, so a scale insect is a pretty nasty little creature that tends to form a shell on the leaves, but not only, on the stems of plants in general, and actually feeds on the vital juices of the plant. And if you don't care, take care of it, it will eventually kill your orchid, it will deplete it of moisture. And uh, you have a close-up of this insect on the screen right now. Now, scale insect can vary slightly, it can be brown in color, it can be white, like in my case. In some cases, it can leave some sticky residue on the leaves. This is how you know you have it. In my case, it doesn't, so it's a different type of scale, but nonetheless, it is still scale insect, and uh, the life cycle is the same, and so on. You do have all these informations in the description, so you can visit it and learn more about this creepy crawler. So what I will do is I will try to first manually clean the leaves, the, the healthy leaves that I still have. I will try to use alcohol. I don't have rubbing alcohol, but I will use spirits. I've noticed it doesn't really harm the orchids. If you do have rubbing alcohol, use rubbing alcohol. So I will try to clean it with a cotton uh, bud or um, you know makeup remover disc. And I will try to use an insecticide. Now I don't really like the idea of toxic insecticides, so I'm just gonna use a an insecticidal soap. It's really not as toxic, very very mild. It's just a soap, it's based on potassium and I'm not sure how good it will do but I will use it. And also I want to repot this orchid. There um, might be some crawlers in the media here and also I didn't get a chance to repot this orchid yet so it's a good idea. If you have a massive infestation of scale maybe it's a good idea to change the media as well, clean up the roots as well, wash them and provide fresh media just to you know limit the number of them. Sunidi here on YouTube, I think she managed to get rid of them by uh, regularly using neem oil. I will link you to her video when she had the scale insect problem, how she dealt with it and how she eventually got rid of it. So I think neem oil could work as well, but I will, I will just go with the insecticidal soap for now and uh, yeah, see what happens. Okay, so the first thing I'll do is try to manually remove as many of these insects as I possibly can. So as I told you, I'm gonna use some alcohol and a cotton disc for makeup remover. And then I'll try to rub the leaves and remove these shells. And I'm gonna show you on the cotton bud what's left behind. Okay, so hopefully you can see this, all this gooey stuff. Yeah, these are the insects. Okay, so I'll go and do this on the underside of the leaves as well and as much as I can and then I'm gonna unpot the orchid. Okay, we're back. I disinfected the root system with hydrogen peroxide. I also sprayed a little bit of that insecticide in this area, which I couldn't necessarily reach with my cotton ball. And now it's time to repot it. Now I'll actually use a cymbidium pot. And as for the mix, I'm gonna use bark and some sphagnum moss for some added moisture. Okay, so here we are, we're done. The next thing I will do is actually spray all these leaves with the insecticidal soap. I didn't want to spray them prior to repotting because it's such a big plant. I would have uh, for sure gotten it, got the leaves into my eyes. I'm just clumsy like that. So yeah, I'm gonna take it to the bathtub now and I will spray the entire leaf surface with the insecticidal soap. And what I intend to do is to keep an eye on it. If I see any more spots, I'm just gonna manually remove them once again. After one week, I'll probably spray it with insecticidal soap once again. And hopefully that will do the trick. Okay, so thank you for sending in the suggestion. Hope you found this useful. Do visit the description of this video for more information on scale and how you can keep it under control. And yeah, if you have other suggestions for me for videos, uh, leave me a comment and I'll try to make a video for you guys. Also, don't forget to subscribe if you would like to see more videos from me and visit orkinature.com for our community. I'll see you next time. Take care. Bye.